Hi guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel, and I am so very excited today. Um, if you follow me on any social media, like Instagram or Cosplay Amino specifically, you know that I've been obsessed with uh, Nier Automata lately, and I've been teasing 9S for a really long time, and if you can tell by this video's title, I bit the bullet and ordered 9S. So I'm very, very excited about that. So yeah. Whew. But yeah, I just wanted to say that this video is not in any way sponsored or anything. I'm going to be giving my complete honest review of this costume, you know, because it is from Mick Costumes, so I will have you guys know that this is just going to be a full-on, brutally honest review. So I have the box right here, and the first thing I noticed is that this box has a really good weight to it. I'm not going to show you guys the actual box because it's got my address on it <laughs> and such. So, but yeah, so we're going to cut that open. Yes, I have a knife. Deal with it. I'm always really nervous when I, I'm a little nervous because when I order costumes, you know, I'm always afraid of, you know, what the worst is going to happen. Like, something's going to be wrong with it. But also, they're saying that the blindfold's supposed to be somewhat see-through, but it didn't look like it was see-through, so I'm prepared for it to not be. I'm also prepared for the bag to be a little bit big, and um, there was one other thing. I don't know. But I ordered a size medium, so let's hope everything is... Just... <gasps> oh my god! Ooh, ooh, that's, that's heavy. Oh, okay, so here's the bag. Uh, it says Mick Costumes, cosplay by heart on it. So this is the Mick Costumes bag. I hope you guys can see everything. So this pretty much includes everything except for like the shoes that um, he has. So let's get into this right here. What? Oh, the material is nice. Oh. I was not expecting it to be that nice. Wow. Okay, this is the bag. So yeah, the bag is a little bit big than what his is in the game, but that's okay. Um, ooh, that's nice. It's like a fake leather. Ooh, yes. Yes. Okay, so the strap must be... Oh, thank God, it's got Velcro on it. So this is nice, though, because... I oh my God, that's... Okay. So, here's the strap, the buckle. The buckle is like actual metal. Wow. That's really nice. And I know some people are probably going to be like, his bag's not actually black. Well, it's kind of debatable because in every like, wow, and it's like aged really nicely too. Like, and it feels pretty sturdy. It doesn't feel like the crappy, oh, it feel like a shitty like metal buckle. That's really nice. Thank you. Uh, so that, that, that'll go in these little thingies here. Ooh, and the gloves are in here. And the stockings. Oh, that's neat. Okay, that's a really good way to package. Okay, so here are the gloves. Um, here. Ooh, they. Okay, let's try that on real quick. Ooh. Oh, good, it'll fit my tiny wrists. Ooh, damn, those are tiny. <laughs> Wow, and I have really slender fingers, and these are really tight. Wow, those are going to have to get worn down quite a bit. But I'm glad that they fit. I'm glad that they're, like, actually on my fingers and not, you know, too big. Because someone said they were too big, but I don't know what they ordered. Again, we've got a nice shiny metal buckle. It's kind of, this is kind of a weird design, and I don't know, I was thinking maybe of cutting uh, this part off and putting, attaching it to the sleeve, because I think that's how his actually are. So, okay, gloves out of the way there. And then we got the little, s okay, yeah, this is the blindfold. Alright. I'm not sure if I dig this totally. I can't really see myself, so I'm not sure if I'm going to dig this or not, but I can always make my own. But yeah, okay, so you can see through it. They were showing one on the website that like totally did not look see-through, but okay. I'll look at that later. And then we got his knee socks. These are so cute. 
I don't know. Ooh, these are actually nice. These are like actual sock material. Like I have socks that are similar to this. Um, like black socks that I use for like Sebastian and Vincent that actually feel the exact same as this. So that's really nice. That's really, that's a, and they're stretchy. So that's good. So far I'm liking everything. What the hell is this? Oh, his choker, okay. Okay, you know, I'm not digging the choker, like, at all. Okay, yeah, no, that's really cheaply made. It's like a ribbon. Is this even gonna fit my neck? It's, yeah, it's partially bent, too. Okay, yeah, no, this is, like, too big as well. Okay, yeah, I'm not digging that. That's a little bit of a letdown. It's pretty cheaply made there, but... Oh, well. I've seen some... Uh, what pretty like leather ones that um, on like Amazon and stuff so I'll get one of those so I'm gonna put all this stuff back in the bag for now just so I don't lose it and we're gonna get on to the main costume part good oh damn this is heavy oh, the, oh my god the material is so nice I'm digging it mm -hmm. oh yeah oh Oh, okay, so I'll start with the pants first. It's like a velvety, it's really soft. Wow. Yeah. This is probably gonna rival Sebastian for one of the nicest cosplays I own, cause Sebastian. So these are the pants. They're like super soft. Like, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's almost like a suede or like a velvet. I'd say it's a suede kind of material. It's very soft to the touch. And it's got a little button for the thing and a zipper, so easy on off. Because some of my cosplays have come with like pants where the buttonhole is too small for the button, like Togami. Like just no. Okay. Oh, thank God! I was so worried about this. So the I was worried because you couldn't really see it in the photo. I was worried that his pants wouldn't have the little buttons. Um, but they do, and I like these buttons a lot better than what were on some of the other costumes, uh, cause they look nicer, cause some of them were like fully gold and fully filled in, and I just, I didn't really like it. Yeah, these are nice. They're gonna attract dog hair like nothing else, but, mm. Okay, so here's the coat. Oh, wow. This is nice, actually. So here is the coat. Oh my god. This is like actually embroidered. Like I was expecting this to actually be like just a stamp, like kind of like those clothing stamps that are on, but this is actually like embroidered in. I don't know if you guys can see it real well, but it's embroidered very nicely. And it's like, it's just so soft. I'm not really digging the X's here either. Like the little, they're kind of, they look kind of cheap, but that's okay, I guess. Um, here's the back. Kind of same deal. Wow. I'm actually impressed. Like, wow. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Like, I don't really have a lot of complaints for this costume. This is very nice. Oh my god, the inside is really... How does this open? Oh, okay, so there's like little snaps here to open it. To open the coat. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Oh yeah, okay, that's nice. That's good, because I didn't want it to be Velcro because I feel like Velcro on costumes like that would just ruin it, but wow. Oh my god. That's so nice. Wow. I'm sorry, I'm like, I was, I wasn't expecting shit quality, like, at all, but, like, um, I don't know. I don't know what I was expecting. Um, wow. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so the next part is to try it on for you guys and see if it fits and kind of just show it off. So I'm gonna do that. I will be right back. Sweet. Everything fits, like, perfectly, and I'll show you guys probably in, like, um, some video, oh my god, my brother's on. In some video that I'll make 
um, for this or some photos. I'll show you the full costume. Yeah, overall this costume is fantastic. It's way better than I expected it to be. I can see out of the blindfold. And for the most part, I don't think you can see my eyes too well, so that's good. Um, I'm comfortable in it. It's nice. Um, and I'm probably going to end up cosplaying 2B as well, because waifu. But, um, I mean, so maybe I'll order from them again, because this costume is amazing. Um, so for overall comfort, I'm going to give this a 5 out of 5, because just, wow, it it's super comfortable. It's so very nice. For detail, I'm gonna give it a 5 out of 5 because the embroidery on the little things is amazing. The buttons are so nice and then the little buckle is metal and aged and it's amazing. Um, for overall quality, I'm giving it a 4.5 out of 5 and the reason I'm doing that is because of this necklace. Um, it, it's just cheap and it kind of takes away just an itty bitty little bit of the grand scheme of the costume and I think that honestly if this was made a little bit better if the t see I would be fine if it was this was just the ribbon right but if this was like maybe like a pleather and stuff or a thicker material and it had like not bent it would have been 10 times better and it probably would have gotten a 5 out of 5 Oops. Um, and in terms of everything being included, everything for this costume was included, so everything that Nyanas basically has was included, aside from like the sword and the shoes. So like, honestly I don't really have to complain about anything missing. The blindfold is actually see-through, I mean it is a little disorientating at first, and it's kind of hard to get on because of the material on a synthetic wig. But other than that, everything is amazing, and I actually got this costume from my costumes on like it's absolutely fantastic um i definitely recommend this costume to any near automata fans because wow it's good and if you haven't played the game play it it's so good but i will leave a link to not only the mick costumes version of this like the mick costume site but also the uh, link where I bought this actual costume so that you can see if they have your size. I believe their 2B one is also on Amazon through them. But yeah guys, so, yeah if you guys want to see me do more cosplay unboxings or cosplay related unboxings, leave a like and a comment. And subscribe please for more cosplay related content because I'm going to be doing a lot as 9S. I'm excited. <laughs> Um, but yeah guys, uh, that's pretty much it, and keep calm and cosplay, and I'll see you guys in the next one.